In sweep number 14, we're looking at the first of two near 10 subtraction strategies. This is taking away nine. Here's an example. We have 15 on the board. So we have um, a group of 10 and five. If we were taking away nine with the 10 frames, this is not difficult at all. You can see there's 10 here. If we took away nine, that would be easy. We can relate this to the question 15 take away 10 which like other number facts we've talked about before is really a place value question. 15 is made up of a group of 10 and five extra ones. That's why we write it as one five for 15. If we were to take away 10, we're just taking away one digit basically and there's only the ones left and that would be five. So if we know that taking away 10 will equal five, we don't even need the counters really. We can see that if we only took away nine, one less, there'd be one more left over. That would leave six. The 10 frame makes it clear. Let's look quickly at an open number line. Let's take a different example. So we'll say uh, 16. So we're going to do 16, take away nine. We will go back to 10 first. There's 10, that's taking away six. We're taking away nine. That means taking away another three after we get to the 10. 10 take away three is seven. There we go. Of course, we've got the turnaround facts as well. Let's quickly deal with that. 15 take away 9 is 6, but 15 take away 6, we have the same sort of easy computation to do. It's sort of a compensation because we can take 5 away quickly, take another one that will leave 9. And we could do similar sorts of things with our open number line. That's it for this strategy. See you next time.